what's poppin' with my sunny ass? Alright, so we're gonna try to get the the Mandalorian Season 2 Episode 1 review in 5 minutes. So make sure you hit that like, comment, subscribe, and I'll um be happy. Alright, so look, all right, the, the um, episode starts off really cool, you know what I'm saying? It starts off cool, you know what I'm saying? It starts off with him, you know what I'm saying? Baby Yoda, they walking through, the, you know what I'm saying? They walking through the town, you know what I'm saying? Then, um... They go to the bar and uh, they're like they're watching. I don't know the um, that the exact alien that are fighting in the arena, but they're fighting. Oh, and by the way, spoilers, spoilers. So if if you don't want to be spoiled, click off right now. Click off right now. All right, all right. So they're watching their fight, and then he asked the, he asked this other alien. He was like, um, so do you know where I can find any of the other Mandalorians at? Because he's looking for Mandalorians to help him find the baby's owner. You know, like he was in the um, season one. So um. The dude said, the dude, dude was like, he said, said something like, hey, it's hey, it's not cool to rush, you know what I mean, rush, rush the negotiation. And, um, so then they, they, um, so then, uh, Mando just chills, and after that, after, like, the fight, the fight is about to end, he, the, um, dude tells him to, um, place a bet for his armor, and he was like, I'm not doing, uh, Mando was like, I'm not doing that. He, either you gonna, either... Like he was, he was like, I, I brought, I brought money to pay you. He's like, I brought money to pay you. We ain't gotta do all that. So then the dude shot, shot the wrestler. Um, dude shot the wrestler, and then it was over. They was all pointing the guns at Mando. He was like, We can do this the easy way or the hard way. The choice is yours. You know, as you know, the dude did it the hard way, and he ended up getting eaten a lot. But oh, but he, and he ended up telling him um, where to search for a Mandalorian. No, it's Tatooine, and this gave me immediately, immediate nostalgic vibes, because, you know, it's not where, it's not where technically it, it all began, but in the storyline, that's where it technically all began, Tatooine. Whew. So, they went to Tatooine, and, um, it's a little, there was a little callback from season one, where, um, the lady was like, oh, we know he doesn't like droids, but we, we know now that he does, he does like droids more than he did before he left Tatooine. Because remember, I can't remember. It was the assassin joy. The assassin joy. He warmed up to him, cause you know what I'm saying. He he was reprogrammed, and he took care of Baby Yoda. And he was he was just cool. Can I get a can I get a um R I P for um the assassin joy? But yeah, um what else? Okay, so after that, bruh, bruh, he goes into the bar. Oh my god, I thought it was Boba Fett, but it wasn't Boba Fett. It wasn't Boba Fett. It was freaking a dude named Marshall in a Boba Fett armor. And I was tripping. Oh, my God. Like, I was laying down. I was asleep. I seen the Boba Fett armor. I turned my light on. I hopped right up. I wasn't playing none of that. And, like, I just lost my mind. You know what I'm saying? I lost my mind. And then he took out the mask, and I'm like, oh, this ain't Boba Fett. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'm like, clones ain't got hair. You know what I'm saying? And their hair ain't blind. I mean, except for Rex. But I think he dyed his blind. But back to the topic. That was crazy. Oh my god, that was crazy. Yeah. Alright, so um as soon as he took off his mask, uh Mando was tripping. He was like, take out the armor or we're gonna have a problem. Stop playing with me. Take off the armor or we're gonna have a problem. Stop playing with me. Take off the armor or we're gonna have a problem. Stop playing with me. The bro the dude was like, We gonna really do this? We gonna really do this? Like we gonna really do this? Like we gonna really do this was good. He was like, we gonna really do this was good. Was good. Man, Amanda was like, we gonna really do this. And then, and then all you hear is a big earthquake. And then they stop. They go outside and um, they put the little curl. Um, they put that little argument to the side. And they was like, what's going on? He was like, this big little dragon. And it kind of gave me vibes from the Clone Wars where um, it was this dragon that they got. I can't remember, but it was a dragon. It was also another dragon that was underground, and they had trouble killing. And um, Palpatine wanted it because they can. It was the skin was so strong, but I think this was a different type of dragon. So long story short, the um, the dude named Marshall said if Mando helps him kill the um, the dragon, then he'll give him the armor because um, it'll help the village. So you know Mando, you know what I'm saying? Mando, you know what I'm saying? He nasty, you know what I'm saying? He, you know what I'm saying? He's starting to slide. He's like easy work, you know what I'm saying? Put up his sleeves, you know what I'm saying? Mando pulled up his sleeves. He went to Tuscan Raiders, started started busting out the Tuscan um Tuscan um Tuscan um language. He was like <laughs> he was speaking all that, and um you know what I'm saying? The Tuscan Raiders and the village worked together, and um they blew a hole in him, 
And then um, that's it. But um, after that, it was this dude with a thing. It was a dude in the back with his thing in his back. And that was, I don't know who it was, but that was the episode. And um, that's the review in five minutes. Make sure you hit that like, comment, subscribe, and um, um, stay tuned for next week. We will be reviewing episode two. Or should I say episode 10? But um, it's your boy KY signing out. Peace.